Uh, from the Roaring Twenties to World War II, and yes, the dot-com boom. One local family business has seen it all, and they're still up and running. Queen City News reporter Maury Words takes a trip to Albemarle to discover the secret of a lasting uh, a whole century. Why do you do this? Well, this is what my family does. This is what my family does. There's steam, starch. Not even resident. You got it. Shirts. All lining a complicated labyrinth. Unsolvable to most, unless your family. Every time we letter a truck or do something, we put on there since 1922 because there's not many businesses that have made it that long. Meet Mark Dry. Good afternoon, Benton Dry speaking. And his brother, Benton Dry. You, you would get that over, over the years that uh, well, you're the dry cleaning business. Yeah, we are. It's a joke the Dry brothers have never, ever, ever, ever heard before. That of course their family business is dry cleaning. And we're going to be in the dry cleaning business regardless of which business we talk about. Dunright Dry Cleaners in Albemarle is one of the oldest dry cleaning businesses in North Carolina. It's unusual for sure. And Mark says it's something his family never thought would happen when they started it in 1922. Uh, I doubt it. Mo most companies like this probably run 30 or 40 years and they sail. But there is a secret to lasting a century. Because even though the technology and the clothes have changed over the decades, one thing hasn't. It, it was run uh, day to day, uh, month to month, year to year, and everybody gave their all for it. The two know it's not just clothes they're dry cleaning. It was my best friends from my childhood. We grew up together. And she said, don't buy a dress, I've got two. And then I tried this one on and it was, oh, it's amazing. It's what people spend their lives wearing their money on and make memories in. There was a stain inside the bodice. He got everything out. Even though it's run by the Dry family, the family treatment extends to all. Yes, ma'am, you can. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. You're very welcome. We appreciate your business. It takes hard work, to be sure. We're not lucky. We're blessed. But cleaning and caring, that's just what the Dry family does. With photojournalist Jack Anderson, Maureen Wirtz, Queen City News. Hard work that is very heartfelt. The family has made sure they help out the community as much as possible over the years. In fact, over the last 30 years, they've donated over 100,000 coats to kids in need.